I'm Zardis, and let's play Planet Zoo. Welcome to Zarzu. This will be episode one in the series. And what I want to do is, I want to do a sandbox zoo, and I really want to get things moving quickly. And uh, I have a new recording format, if you've seen some of my videos before. But uh, what, we're, what I do now is I try to intermix time lapse and live play. So we'll do live play, I'll talk about a few things, then we'll do a quick little time lapse as I do stuff, and so on and so forth. But uh, anyway, what I've done for this zoo is I've tried to really get things uh, set up to begin with. We're going to be using a lot of blueprints to make things go faster, and a prefab uh, buildings from the game itself. But what I'm really after is the vision for the whole park. I'm not really here to make super detailed buildings. I'm not so good at that. Other people are much better, and you can see I've already picked out quite a few buildings. I've divided the park into different areas, and um, when we get to each part, I will uh, talk about any blueprints I'm using in that area. Today we're going to work on the Australia section, which is up here, but I also have, so we have entrance area, we have gardens and Europeans, so like flamingos will go in there. We have, this is the research center, this is the hospital, this will be maintenance back along here. This is North America, this is South America, this is Africa, this is Asia, and then this is a concert lawn, or it will be, and this will be a, a little hotel and a campground back here. That is the plan. And you can see the different terrain is kind of how I've planned things out and where things are going to go. So let's go ahead and come in here and work a bit on so uh, Australia. So what I want to do is I have the, the rock texture is where I want the restaurant and any guest facilities to go. So we will get started with that. So we've got the restaurant in here, and uh, this is the, uh, what is it called, the Sydney Zoo Boulevard Eatery by Cannibal Alien. So it's a pretty cool building, and it has the shops that we need, and what I want to do is I want to get over here, we're going to have koalas open, or like it uh, accessible here for people eating. So that'll be the plan for that area. Then what I want to do is uh, we need to get some staff buildings in this area, and I think I want them to go back here. Okay, so that'll be koalas. Then we are going to also get a reptile house in here somewhere.
Okay, so there we have reptiles. And then uh, next we're going to work on this exhibit, which is AU5. And I have named or designated that as Southern Cassowary. Okay, and that is going to be in that space there. So what we want is a barrier here. Actually, we need to find out what size barrier we need. And we'll go from there. Southern Cassowary. We need a grade two. Uh, okay. And, oh yeah, uh, Kuala's one needs to be not climbable. Okay, so let's get some animals in here now. And actually, we can unpause the game. Well, first, I want to set up a uh, word zone, though. So, my idea with, with the word zones is that I want to have a word zone for each area, and then we're just going to have all of the staff share different things. So we can unpause here. And then we should have the staff moving around in there. Yeah, why are those not open? The zoo is open, but no power. Okay. Okay, so that should work now, and we just need to come in here. We need some staff here. We need a caretaker. We're gonna pause it so that we can get these in here. We're gonna get two caretakers assigned to this area. We're gonna get, we need, we have two habitats already, so let's get two keepers. And then we have four exhibits that we're going to set up. Good four of these. I mean, we're sandbox, so we can have as much staff as we want. Let's get two maintenance. And let's get a security guard. Get uh, two security guards for now. And a vet in this area. Okay, so now we want to get all of them onto these work zones. No idea which one of them we just hired. So we're gonna come down here. Wow, we have a lot of keepers. And I don't remember. Uh, yeah, those are the ones we just hired. I don't know what that was about, but let's get them assigned. Okay, so they are all in there now, and we should have those shops are open. Very good. So let's come in here. We're first going to get these exhibits up and running. So this one, uh, actually, we need to get some animals. Exhibit training. Trading. We want common death adder. Yep, here we go. Let's get one of you. Adopt and a female. Animal storage. We want to come here. We want both of you send to zoo. There. Okay. Then we want the eastern blue tongued lizard. Eastern blue tongued lizard. Let's get a male. I guess this is female. 
the mail. You send to you there. We'll get the things set up in just a moment. Then the Eastern Brown Snake. And finally, the Giant Burrowing Cockroach. Those are the ones that I have selected for this area. And for now, I have a lot of... Uh, I have pretty much all the same rules going. So are you in here? We want temperature. Get these set. Okay, so that is the exhibit. So now let's come over and we'll get some koalas in here. And eventually I want to come in and we'll get some patios and stuff like that in here. But for now, let's go ahead and get these out of here. Okay, uh, koalas. And the southern cassowary. Southern Cassowary, that's this one, this one, okay, so that will get that, we're going to rename these habitats. And they have to be delivered. They have a long way to go to be delivered. Because so I think they come in probably somewhere in here. I don't know where where they got put, but it'll take a good while to get there. And then we can go from there. Now, in the meantime, we can do a little bit of terrain work here. And actually, we have some fillers somewhere. We want here. Yeah, so I think this uh, week I will probably get some of work done off camera to get some things set up. But in the meantime, uh, this is kind of what we're doing right now. Where are these people? Relocating. Where are you right now? What staff is moving it? Alright, so that should, I mean, that, that should get them going. I don't know where, where they are. Yeah, this is all, oh yeah, we need a facility out here too. Alright, well, I think that is where we're going to leave it our exhibit animals are having lots of offspring now, which is 
good and bad. That means we're going to have more to have to deal with. But I think we will leave it here for this week. I will do some off-camera work, like I said, and try to add some more to this area. And that will be the plan. Next week, we will continue working on Australia. So anyway, that's it for today. I hope you liked it. If you did, let me know. If you didn't, well, let me know that too. But also, let me know what area you want to work on after Australia. So we're going to work all on this area and get this all working and up and uh, nice and stuff like that. But then we'll move on to a different area. But anyway, thanks for watching, and I will catch you next time. Take care.